to another video in today's video i'm just going to be using uh the live stream from last week um where i talk about uh the importance of mentors what i look for in a mentor um and also the mindset around uh surrounding yourself with people that can teach you things so i hope you enjoyed the video it's a bit of a chilled video because it's from one of the live streams um but yeah if you enjoy it let me know uh, drop any questions or comments down in the comment section below and I will get back to you um, But yeah, have a good day and I'll see you in the next video When if you were to take a trader that doesn't know or Not doesn't know uh, Isn't consistently profitable um, But they think that they're close And I say think because I was um, <clears throat> For many years I thought I was close, but I really wasn't. Um, and when I got my mentor, it was kind of a, um, a realization, I guess, of how lazy I had been. And I think that's why people should have a mentor. Uh, and I think that's why, I think that's why people shouldn't, not don't like, but I think that's why people should sometimes get angry with their mentor because your mentor is there to push you into uncomfortable places um, and a lot of forex trading mentors and whatever are nice to people because they they want them as clients right if i tell you for example you're being lazy um and you know you should stop listening to your wife boyfriend parents um you should you should move out of your house you should um throw away the the ps4 or ps5 whatever xbox um wake up at five o'clock in the morning do a workout have a cold shower don't eat junk food um all the rest of it and every single time you don't do it i you know i i, I tell you the truth you're probably not going to like me but at the end of the day if you consistently get on a call with someone that is pushing you you'll get up to that level right um i think i think the problem with a lot of people a lot of people is <clears throat> they are the they are the best in their in their circle let me actually um open up Something. Some of you might have seen this before in um, one of my other streams. But basically, this is the concept. So, uh, wait, hold on, you've got one here, and you've also got one here. So, this is, let's say, uh, 10 mil plus. 10 m plus. This is net worth, okay? Um, in this box, it's... Um, I don't know, whatever, I'm just gonna... Thingy. So uh, this is the top 10%. This is the bottom uh, 10%, okay? Top 10%, bottom 10%. Or top, thingy, thingy, thingy. Okay, so there you go. Um, so one of the problems with, or one of the reasons why people should have a mentor is because a lot of people stay in that top 10%, right? Um, this is actually, I've drawn this wrong, but you'll get the idea. Um, so the top, um, the top um 10 percent of this bracket here so let's say this is nk or minus 10k so this is 10 this is people with less than 10k um net worth and then it just goes up okay so i know that 10k is quite high but whatever um the majority of people are obviously in the middle, right? And when people get into that top 10%, um, this is, these are the people that they're surrounding themselves with. So they feel good, 
right? And in every single one of these top um, kind of uh, sections, people feel good. And if they were to move into that next section, let's say level one, level one, level two, level three, and level four. Um, if people move from level one into level two, they're now not the 10%, the top 10%. They're now the bottom 10% and they feel stupid because they went from everyone looking at them and saying, wow, they're amazing to now everyone saying, wow, they're dumb. I know that's a very simple way of saying it, but um, that's the concept. So now they're seeing everyone that's better than them and they now feel not as um, not as good, right? And the challenge is that like the real, um, what's what I'm looking for? Um, the real show of character are the people that move from the top one, top ten percent to the bottom one percent. They're there. If you do that consistently, you'll consistently get better and better and better, and you'll move up this. And soon you'll be in this level four, and everyone that is down here, you'll look and see. You know, some of these people will think that they're amazing like the the person down here because they've surrounded themselves with people that are not at the same level as them they feel like they're amazing um, and they refuse to go up a level because if they do or if they they change their circle and they uh, surround themselves with higher net worth people they will feel like they're not as good so people will stay where they are. Um, which is one of the main problems, right? With jobs. If if you're in a job um, <clears throat> and you're making more than I don't know, Mary down down the office or whatever, you feel really good. Um but obviously, you know, the CEO is maybe here, here, or here. Um, and it's your job to try and get up. But you can't do that in a... Well, you can do that in a job. But what I'm saying is you can't do that in a, in a mentality where you're saying, I'm better than X, right? It has to be... You, you have to be the dumbest person in your friend's group, Right? Otherwise, you're not. It, it's you're, you're not going to grow. Um, <clears throat> so, if you can surround yourself with, you know, if you can surround yourself with a person a level above you, you're doing good. If you can surround yourself with two levels above you, you're doing really good. And if you can surround yourselves with people three levels above you, you're going to jump up these levels super, super fast. Um, so that's the mentality that I kind of have. Um, and I think that's the reason why I'm so big on mentors. Because the mentor is going to bump you up. And even though you feel like the shit in this, they're going to really show you that you're not. And that you're really not as good as you think you are. And that you need to put more work in. Right? And every single time you get to that top 10%, you'll be thinking you're amazing. Um, then you need to get another mentor to get you up that another level to show you there's more to it, right? So th this is the concept that I have when it comes to mentors. Um, and it's why I'm so big on people getting mentors. <clears throat>